Come to me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and lowly in heart, and you will find rest for your souls, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Comfort, O comfort, my people, says your God. 
speak tenderly to Jerusalem and cry to her, that she has served her term, that her penalty is paid, that she has received from the Lord's hand double for her sins. A voice cries out, In the wilderness prepare the way of the Lord, make straight in the desert a highway for our God. Every valley shall be lifted up, and every mountain and hill be made low. The uneven ground shall become level, and the rough places a plain. Then the glory of the Lord shall be revealed, and all people shall see it together. For the mouth of the Lord has spoken, a voice says, cry out. And I said, what shall I cry? All people are grass. Their constancy is like the flower of the field. The grass withers, the flower fades, when the breath of the Lord blows upon it. Surely the people are grass. The grass withers, the flower fades, but the word of our God will stand forever. Get you up to a high mountain, O Zion, herald of good tidings. Lift up your voice with strength, O Jerusalem, herald of good tidings. Lift it up, do not fear. Says, Say to the cities of Judah, here is your God. See, the Lord comes with might, and his arm rules for him. His reward is with him, and his recompense before him. God will feed his flock like a shepherd. He will gather the lambs in his arms and carry them in his bosom and gently lead the mother sheep.
invite you now to choose a position that centers you in the present moment. Sitting up with your feet planted gently on the floor, or maybe lying down on the floor, focusing on the light of the candles or closing your eyes. Notice that you are breathing. Notice how it feels to breathe in and out. Give thanks for your breath as you remember the breath of life that the eternal Christ is continually breathing into us. Breathe in and out. Give thanks for this breath that connects you to God, your neighbor, and all of creation. Place your hand on your chest or your stomach and feel the movement of your breath. Then notice whatever it is that you are feeling right now. Welcome whatever it is that is weighing on your mind or your heart. Don't try to change it or fix it, just notice it. Welcome and acknowledge whatever it is that you are feeling. Now open your eyes and look around. What do you see right now that reminds you of someone or something that you love? And if you want, close your eyes again or focus on the candle. And imagine that you could breathe into your own heart. Allow yourself for a moment to imagine that it is possible to breathe into your spiritual and emotional heart. Now amid, imagine the Christ who is now and who is to come and who always will be. Imagine this eternal Christ breathing directly into your heart. What do you need, what do you want the living, eternal Christ to breathe into your heart right here, right now? What grace do you need this night? Comfort, peace, hope, strength, courage, patience. Breathe in the grace that you need from God and then breathe that grace back out into the world. I invite you to bring to mind now an individual that you care about. Whoever comes to mind is the right one for now. Imagine you and God holding that person cradling that person in your heart and in God's heart. Even if you aren't sure what that might be, let that be your desire, that you and God together would hold this person you care about. As you breathe in and out, imagine you and Jesus breathing God's holy breath God's holy love, compassion, strength, and healing into this individual that you care about. Then together, you and God bless this person with these are similar words. May you be joyful. May you be healthy. May you know that you are loved. May you know that you are not alone. May you know now and always that God is with you now and always.
Now think of a community that you care about. Your church, your school, your work, your family, your city. Imagine you and Jesus holding that community and Jesus' heart and then your own heart. Imagine the eternal Christ breathing God's holy breath into that community, filling that community with love, compassion, strength, and healing. Then you and the living Christ together bless this community that is in your mind. With these are similar words. May you be joyful. May you be healthy. May you know that you are loved. May you know that you are not alone. May you know that God is with you now and always. Now think of the world as a whole. Imagine you and Jesus cradling the whole world in God's heart, in your heart. Imagine you and the eternal Christ breathing God's breath and grace into the world as you pray for and bless the world with these or similar words. May you be joyful. May you be healthy. May you know that you are loved. May you know that you are not alone. May you know that God is with you now and always. As you bring your prayer to a close, give thanks for everyone who is helping right now in the midst of our ongoing crisis. Doctors and nurses, essential care workers, civic leaders, scientists, Include yourself and acknowledge the sacrifices that you have had to make. Offer a prayer of thanks for all those, including yourself, who have made and are continuing to make choices that help save lives. Bring your hand back to your heart. As you feel your breath moving in and out, Give thanks to the living God, the eternal Christ, who is now, has been, and always will be with you. The eternal Christ who longs to comfort you, to share strength with you. Give thanks. Give thanks. Give thanks. As you breathe in and out, remind yourself that Jesus is blessing you as well. You and Jesus bless yourself with these or similar words. May you be joyful. May you be healthy. May you know that you are not alone. Listen to the eternal Christ. Whisper into the deepest part of your mind. May you know that I am with you now and always. Peace I give to you. My own peace I leave with you. Joy I give to you. My own joy I leave with you. Hope 
I give to you. My own hope I leave with you. In the silence that follows, continue to breathe in and out the grace that you long for.
I invite your prayers for yourself, the world. With these and the deepest hearts of our prayers that we don't always have words for, let us pray as our Savior taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen.